When I wake up in the morning, all I need to hear is praise. When I wanna hear the best in the air, all I need to hear is praise. When I wake up in the morning, all I need to hear is praise. And wonder, and I just can't finish my day without my friends. His name is Stephen James Dixon. He's got a book out. The name of the book is Men Don't Heal, We Ho. It's about the emotional instability of men. That caused Essence and others to say, hey, write for us. To where now he has uh, two articles in Essence. One is The Ten Things You Look For in a Man, which is directly related to another article, The Ten Ways to Go from a Girlfriend to a Wife. And when we started, we started talking about these ten ways. And there was a little bit of a debate on and off the air. Like, be a woman all day, every day. Be independent. Stay on your toes. Don't get comfortable and lazy on your man. Turn his house into a home. Be a godly woman. Watch his mama do what she do. You don't have to be his mama. You know I'm what I'm saying? You, said that. you don't have to be his mama. Uh, just learn from But mama. you should learn, learn from him. Right. Learn. Challenge your man. Be your man's biggest fan. Because men need their ego strokes. Nurture every a man. Every day, every minute. Every and then second. lastly, be the freakiest person he knows. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then some people say, what if I do all of that? Yeah, like a lot of women are doing. And it yeah. still don't and work. And he yeah. still get the hell on. And you oh, say yeah. step it's, it's on. Quite, you say keep move it moving. on. Keep, keep it moving. Keep it moving. I, yeah, I wanna, um, yeah, go yeah, ahead. Because cause, uh, it's glad that we, we preface it like that because a lot of women thought that when I wrote something like, oh, if I do this, I'm going to get a man. That's not what I'm saying at all. Oh, if I do this, I'm going to keep my man. Right. That's not what I said at all. And really, the list is also about, as a woman, this is what you should do no matter what. A lot of women looked at it as, this is some type of bonus or extra stuff I'm asking you to do. Look at the list again. What am I asking you that goes beyond and above what, I, what you should be doing anyway as a woman? Be a woman all day. Be a godly woman. Those things you should be anyway. Let's go to the phones. Frank and Wanda. I had a boyfriend. I had a girlfriend of three years, and he broke up with her to be with me. And out of that, I lost my virginity to him, and I got pregnant. But two months later, he left. I don't understand what it is that I did wrong. Oh my yeah, God. yeah. It's it, it, it's not necessarily what you well what you did wrong was dating a man that had another woman. I mean, let's just let's just keep it real did right up front. Did she say his friend? Right, you know, her it, friend. It, you cannot. She had he had she he, he had he had another friend. Okay. Right, and so what you got to do is you you can't just look at the list. You also have to read the book so you can determine what type of right. man to date. Right. And in an in article I wrote for Ten Things uh, about about men, the first thing I say is women do not know how to choose a man. She didn't know how to choose a man, so it wasn't about. How you were interacting with that man? It wasn't about you, honey. Right, you might have right. been the best woman in the world. You might have did all ten things, mm-hmm. but you chose a man that was involved with another woman. You can look at my own personal story. At one time, I was dating a woman I was very interested in, and um, she had an ex boyfriend that she had dated for like five years. That I found out after we had started dating, she was still interacting. Immediately, I knew that I cannot compete with the previous emotions. Mm-hmm. You can't compete with that. I'm not. That's not a competition. I'm going to lose right, every right, time. Right, right. And she should have known you cannot date a man that has a girl. If he's telling you he got a girlfriend, right. there's emotions involved. Right. Subtitled a book, a book about the emotional instability in men. Uh, agree. It's it's a wrap from the beginning. You can, you have to have standards for yourself. You know, the first thing she said was when I started dating him, I knew he had another, another girlfriend that was cool with me. Why? <laughs> Why is that cool? Yeah, it should be When did be that cool. become cool? It's not cool. <laughs> We're going to take it's a break. Cool. We'll come back with more. I told you it was going to be hot. <laughs> Stephen James Dixon is in the building, and uh, we got more with him coming up next on the People Station, V103. All right, well, we had some conversations off the air that were very explosive in here, and we're going to share a couple of those with you, Wanda. Okay, I just want all women to listen to this because I'm still learning as well. Now, Frank and Steven said this. They both agreed. When we get with the guy, we're just, you know, we we fall in love with what we see. We like him. We like everything about him. Now, Frank explained that there's three things that a man break down that he like in a woman, and Steven agreed. He have to be emotionally attached. That's one. That's one. Now, that's one level. Okay. Like okay. what I was, okay. what I was okay. saying let me, is. Let me just throw all okay. three of them out there. Okay. You have to be emotionally attached. Right. Okay. You have to, uh, he have to know what, uh, what you represent. Right. Okay. And also what he does with you. So there's three things. Emotional, what you represent, 
and what he does with that's you. the wholeness of the relationship right so there's three parts okay. when a man becomes now, now attached break to down a woman emotionally what that means because there's three things that is very important that i think women should know because it when we when we like you, we see you. We like everything about you. We like your look. We like your swag. We like your clothes. We like the way you walk. We like the way you sex us. We like everything about you, the way you kiss. But it's not like that for men. Explain men, to me. Men develop those things at different times. Okay. And you don't necessarily develop all three with one woman. Right. So you can be emotionally attached to a woman and really like her and care about her. Right. And want to make sure she's all right. And whatever, but that ain't necessarily your hanging partner. Right. That you know, whatever. Okay. Um, there's women that the women that you like what they represent, like what you represent for me as a man. Like, like you may like you, to take me. You out. make me better. Right. That I'm, whole thing. So you I'm make the, me I'm, better. I can be a trophy piece. I can be the girl trophy you take piece, to a picnic or the family, out. a club, or you to make a me, meeting. You make me look good. Right. You you know, you build me up like you're that. So you may just like me for that one thing. Absolutely. And then wow. and then there is the action woman. And that is the woman I like doing what I like to do with you. Right. And, and, and the difference between men and women is if we like you for that one item, we may not leave you because we like you for that one item. <sighs> Whereas a woman will say, I only like you for this one thing. I'm leaving. You That's know, crazy. They don't, women yeah. understand better what they want. Whereas men is like, I like you just for the emotional connection. I'm going to put you in that lane. That's what you're going to be. Guys have girlfriends. So that that's they like, all y'all really think. Guys yeah, have yeah. girlfriends wow, that they like y'all. just hanging out with and having you might sex hang out with. Girlfriend. You just might like, I just girlfriend. may be the girl you like to take to the movies and, yes. and yes. go to the club yes. with. You yes. may not want to sex me. Right. May not. May not. So probably. you may find that in another girl. <laughs> right. That's not and so, cool, and so really, y'all. Yeah, it's not cool. And so what I write about also in the book. <laughs> And, and what I write about, hold on, hold on. Tell me because I'm I, What I also write about in the book, too, once you figure that out, right. is I write about there's three different packages that we, that men kind of put women in. Okay. Either you the whole package, the girlfriend package, or the wife package. <gasps> and so it's too many yeah. women who think they're the girlfriend and they're just the hoe. Right. It's too many in girlfriends. Your mind, in your mind, in my mind, that's what that's you look. That's what you are. Yeah. But so, you're treating me, but you're doing things for me. You're taking care of me, but in your mind. I may or may not be taking care of you. It's all about in our interactions. Mind. Like Frank said yeah. earlier, it's about quality time. And so you may think you wife package or wife material, but you really just girlfriend. So it's also about where you put yourself and how you deliver to your man. How so you when do we know? Man. When do we know that we are not the whole chick? To you? I'm gonna tell See, you. I'm gonna tell you. Please break that down. You, to my you start to know, and women should really pay attention to a man's action mm-hmm. when it comes to sacrifice mm-hmm. and quality time. For instance. For instance, if me and Steven are going to the ball game, right. and that's my man, and we hang out and go to right, the game, right, and you right. just know we go to the game. Right. And I just say, you know what? I'm going to tell Steve I don't really want to hang with him tonight. I just want to come over and see you. Okay. And we so got, that means and we're not you doing put nothing. me. And we don't have to do nothing. We, we ain't got chill. nothing So planned. I need to be paying attention to, oh, he put Steven aside, and I know he loved to do that to be with me. It's quality time. When a man starts changing his quality time right. and making those sacrifices and whatever in the whole nine yards, when holidays come around, he's planning the holiday with you. Like, he's planning Valentine's with you. Like, summertime is coming. Where are we going together this summer? That's what Not for know, the woman right. to say, can we take a trip this summer? Like, the man says, wow. where are we going this wow. summer? Wow. You know what I'm saying? That wow. type of thing. I got to go get a new suit. Would you come with me and help me pick it out? That means that you're yes. starting to ha- develop Yes, I me. need to get some new shoes. Should I get these shoes or those shoes? What do you think about this in my house? Oh, yes, what y'all. do you think about this in my house? What, should, right. what, what, should, what color should I paint this, this living room right here? so important. Right. Honestly, when sisters, a man says, you know what, my lease is coming up, and really, I don't really feel like signing the lease. Why don't we just put it together? Co mingle. This makes so <laughs> much sense, and I hope women are yeah. listening. All right, okay. we're going to take a quick break. Now, okay? when we come back, can we, can when we come back, can you explain the whole I have Why a Why men are not connected to their kids? Please! That's explain. too deep. Y'all That's too don't need this radio. Can we do that? Please! I don't know do if we can do that next. on the radio. We got to do this. This is it's crazy. Too deep. Please! Frankie. 